Welcome back, everybody. My name is All Funny Games. I stream every day on Twitch TV, and I also make videos here on YouTube. Well, 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 we've approached ourselves a little tiny little thing that's kind of in the middle of where we want to get to. So, how do we get across? If you've ever came across such a thing, you're probably wondering why are there not bridges and don't starve together? What the heck? Where are those bridges at? Well, they're not here yet. Do I think they'll ever make one? Maybe. Is there a fix for one right now? Kind of. So let's talk about the easiest way to make a temporary boat bridge and a permanent one as well, shall we? So let's get into it. Okay, real quick. All you got to do is as you walk around the world, gather a little bit of grass and a little bit of twigs, specifically two twigs and a grass. And you can now craft yourself none other than our handy dandy brand new graph, graft, <laughs> grass raft kit. Um, it is eight grass and two twigs. This is recently came out and probably a few few updates ago. And essentially what you will do is now make a tiny little raft. And essentially what I use these for is crossing over and basically making yourself a bridge. Now, depending on how, how far over you are, you might have to obviously use a paddle, which is also able to let you do that without, I'm obviously in creative mode right now, but I'll show you that this, uh, the ability to make an ore and actually making the grass raft is not required for any science machine or anything. So yes, you might have to position this a specific way so it's right in between, but as soon as you do so, you're perfectly fine. Now, the thing with the grass raft that you kind of have to worry about is the durability of it. So for example, if I go ahead and I grab this piece of grass here and I walk over, over to here, well, you are not going to be able to see these stats, but essentially what you're going to see is a, it's going to degrade over time. So as it starts at 200 HP or whatever you might want to call that durability, you would then need to obviously repair it. And each piece of grass will te technically bring it up just a smidge more. So this is only a temporary piece of the puzzle that you need to actually walk across and make sure that, you know, over time, if you want these to stay or if you want to keep making more, you can. It's just going to cost you a little bit of resources each time. Of course, there's permanent ways to to actually get across the bridge or sorry, to get across the water and make a bridge. And that's by just making a regular boat, which is quite obvious. As if you've mentioned or if you've actually had a chance to play Don't Start Together a lot, you probably had a chance to actually see what a boat looks like. And if you haven't, this is the easiest way to essentially make yourself a nice little permanent bridge. As these will not go anywhere, they're much larger and they won't go bad over time unless something is actually hitting it or if it catches on fire and such and such and such like that. So yeah, you have a temporary one now at the cost of eight grass and two twigs, or of course you have a permanent one that you can upgrade, put an anchor on and turn into a boat. They're both technically boats. It's just that this one has no overall damage loss just by sitting still. So using these as bridges is probably your best bet, but it depends on what kind of resources you have. So early game, you could of course make that, but in order to create this, you definitely need a think tank, which requires none other than your basic science. Once you're able to actually get that, you're able to create yourself <clears throat> the little think tank. And once you get yourself the think tank, you're now able to make the boat. So yeah, you have to have the think tank in order to do so. But like I said, once you do have that, you can play it around and upgrade it, add some barriers, whatever you wanna do. But I mean, of course it is a cost of four sets of boards. So, you know, that's entirely up to you if you wanna use, um, you know, set amount of, uh, a set amount of logs to create the boards, to create the boats. I think these ones are better to use, but of course I've seen a lot of people actually using the uh, the little grass ones for walking across just temporarily, but just be careful because like I said, they do go bad over time. I don't know exactly the amount of time it takes before it completely actually goes bad. Um, the inside mod doesn't exactly give us an, an exact number, but from what I've seen, it lasts about a day or so, day or two, it looks like. Um, but so you could technically, like I said, keep upgrading it. You do need to be on the raft to upgrade it. Um, but at the same time, it's really up to you. Um, I for sure, like I said, I, I like the permanent one just because eventually you can be turned into a regular boat after. But if you don't want to make it look fancy, or if you do want to look at, make it look even more fancy, you can do some cool things if you do turn it into a little boat bridge, where of course you can have like a cool light source on on it and all that other stuff so there's a lot of endless possibilities to really add to it so it just depends on like what you want to like make it look like and you know if you just want it to be a regular boat bridge it's completely up to you but nonetheless i just want to showcase how to make a bridge and don't starve together at least for now until we maybe see bridges down in the future i think this game could really use like kind of like a rope draw bridge basically like one end with like two little just like you would see in any type of movie that has where they're crossing across like a giant uh, cavern um 
and you know i think that probably would be pretty cool to see like you know little pillars here a little like wood walkway over here and over here you can make a grass bridge and stuff too maybe it, like doesn't have enough durability i don't know who knows but i do think that eventually we will see it it's just as of right now we don't have it uh, available to us so we got to use boats thanks again for watching i'll see you in the next one